matches in Nigeria were postponed from yesterday and so all of them are taking place today and that's talking about with 23 games and we're off and away it is Warri Wolves with a kickoff as I told you earlier playing from left to right on your screen uh, long glove forward is searching and these two sides made a lot of changes some of them actually uh, made changes in mid-season and we this season and that opportunity there to that be goal number one oh, great defending in the end seven heartland their blushes it was so close the goalkeeper totally beaten there up on Basi, but the flag is up and they better remember he's already on a yellow card that was the man actually that was tripped there and there's a free kick to worry wolves the place held up for that switch to be made on heartland at the moment A bit of confusion in the defense of Hartland. That that's the way it should be. He gave himself a rest and allowed his players some rest as well. Worry Wolves counter attacking now, Michael Egbeta. Uh, it's a goal kick. Safe hands uh, for Hartland of Uweri. A barren first half uh, sets the stage uh, nicely indeed for an explosive uh, second half here. Between Hartland and Worry Wolves, Nigerian Premier League Week 23 action. And away we go now. Hartland with a kickoff that time. Okawuchi and Kofermata. And, uh, and, well, a rather surprise shot. He wanted to catch the goalkeeper on our ways. In. But it goes to the wrong foot, and it's uh, Worry Wolves taking over now. Good defending, just kept the ball in, and the flag goes up. The flag went up, and it's going to be a throw into Worry Wolves, who's one of whose players is down there and uh, looking a little bit uh, worried as well. That's uh, Michael Egueta had his ankle clipped. Defensive head that gets the ball away. Egueta, the ball given away now is Kalu. Kalu Oji. He hooks it away hopelessly. Ebukao Kafo. It's a Kiko Egyosu that gave him the ball. Ebukao Kafo tries to return the compliment. And it's left with that shot. And what a save! What a, an incredible save there. It is almost goal number one to Warri Wolves and Michael that took that one well from between the defender's legs and the goalkeeper just went down quickly enough to clutch it. Very, very smart indeed. Just watch uh, when that ball was played in, he simply took his legs off in front of the keeper, but uh, he was very, very alert, Basi Akpan, to get down low to his right and save that one at his near post. Very dangerous signal of intent as far as the Wolves are concerned. Efu. Long ball forward looking for Kufar Mata. A uh, good play from Egbenta. Oji. Hartland trying to piece it together, but finally giving the ball away. And Egyosu is running. Egyosu has been impaired. Imaolo will racing back with him. And uh, finally, Imaolo will go in down. And in a Agwekwe, possibly the tallest man on the pitch here, rising very high to get that ball away. And Egyosu goes down in a hip. There is a counter attack from Gori Woods. gives the ball away and uh, you can hear each time it touches the ball there will be this urgency from the crowd they have reason to be anxious because uh, we are under the third uh, it's under three minutes now to go under three minutes to go it's still goalless here between Hartland and Worry Wolves and it's looking like we're going to see another case of shared points here between these two sides whose first game ended 2-2 two -two. today it is goalless the venue is that Anyam Stadium in Oweri. And they made us at that time, one, two. They didn't take it. More like uh, 
Well, let's see what you got and let's see how we defend what you've got. Another crunchy affair that time. Really solid tackle coming from Minojo. Eight additional minutes. And uh, finally, it is all over here. And finally, Warri Wolves have fed the uh, Hatland back in their kinds. It was a draw, 2-2 two -two in the first leg between these two sides in Warri. And it is goalless here between these two sides. Gina Duefu looking crestfallen. And that would have given his side the, the three maximum points at stake here. And Coach Aibogu impressing player after player. Aibogu impressing player after player. Mike took better getting his turn there. And uh, of course, it's all smiles for Warri Wolves. Ekigo Ekiosun didn't get on the score sheet today. But then, and Warri Wolves have come here, seen and not been conquered. It is Hatland nil, Warri Wolves nil.